Hey guys, welcome to my little Toronto apartment. This video is in collaboration with Buns. I share this apartment with my boyfriend. We've been here for about four years together. So take your shoes off, relax, and I'll show you around. We opted for a little bit of an older building. You tend to get more space in Toronto in the older buildings, and we live in a one bedroom apartment here in the city. One of the places that I think we both spend the most time is in the kitchen. We love making coffee at home and my favorite way to make coffee is in the Chemex. It's super hipster but I think it actually does make a difference in taste. It'd be good for Instagram photos and the coffee's good so try it out. I'm just making some of my favorite coffee from a local coffee shop. I got the Chemex for my birthday a couple years ago and honestly haven't looked back. I would call my apartment a work in progress when it comes to decor. We've been slowly acquiring things over time and we are trying to invest in quality pieces as opposed to trendy pieces. So you're going to see a lot of a mix of Ikea, handmade, home scents, stuff my parents gave me. We really try to fill our space with things that have meaning to us. So things like art was either something that we bought original or something that we bought while traveling that had a lot of meaning and memory to us. And a lot of the pieces in our place, like our coffee table was handmade by a friend, things like that. So everything in our apartment, we want to be able to take with us from place to place. So we're actually really lucky to have a little breakfast nook in our place. I got this table at West Elm for more than half off and when we got the table we needed to get new chairs and we wanted something a little bit more eclectic and something that had a little more character than something that you would buy in the store. So that's when I looked to Buns. So if you haven't heard of Buns, it's an online app and community where you can trade and shop local with people in your city. So if you're looking for things like furniture, house plants, clothing, even if people have baked cookies and they want to give them away, you can look to Buns to find the things that you're looking for. So I actually found these two chairs on Buns and I traded them for a giant suitcase that I never used and she refurbished and painted these chairs herself. She was so cute and it was just an awesome experience and that's why I love using buns. You get these memorable experiences and you're minimizing waste and getting rid of things that you don't need for things that you do. It's free to use and buns is available all over the world so you can just find your buns community and start trading and making friends. We live in a one bedroom apartment, so we've had to compartmentalize the space. This desk doubles as a workspace and my vanity. This desk is where I do all of my editing and it's also where I store all of my makeup and where I do my makeup every single morning. Moving down the hall, we have a couple of storage closets. I'm not gonna let you see in there and then it just moves into the bedroom. The bedroom gets the best light out of the whole space and I love spending time in here. It's still a decorative work in progress for sure. I tried to warm up the space by hanging up my hats. We got a little handmade macrame to hang up and I've got some plants, both fake and real, in here. But there's still some things I definitely want to warm up. But it's really nice to have a one bedroom apartment, especially since the bedroom is so far separated from the living room. So my boyfriend and I can have our separate spaces if we ever need it, cause Lord knows sometimes you do. I'm only gonna show you my half of the closet. I keep my shoes and I like to keep everything hanging so I can see it. Another really cool thing about Buns is that they have their own digital currency that you can earn while you're trading. And you can use that currency to trade with local businesses. So you can get clothes from places like Cotton, you can get coffee, and it's just a way to keep that sustainability factor going. And please don't judge my feeble attempt at a Marie Kondo fold. So much joy right there. 
Moving into the bathroom, it is tiny but functional and I actually kind of like it. It is super retro and has all the original tiling and we tried to warm it up as much as we could. These are my favorite pieces of art in the whole apartment. We got these in Paris from an artist and photographer in La Marais, so that was really cool. This is just where I keep all my skincare and the things I use mostly every single day. So this is our little Toronto apartment. These are all the little nooks and crannies that make our space our home. I hope you guys liked it. And if you're interested in learning more about buns, check out the link in the description down below. And happy trading. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.